Right, my second review of the week is my eyeliners. I have four eyeliners here. I've got L'Oreal Paris Superliner Blackbuster. I have Collection 2000 Extreme 24 Hour Felt Tip Liner. Um, Maybelline New York Master Precise and Scandalize Thick and Thin Eyeliner. I'm going to tell you what I like about these products or maybe dislike. I'm going to start off with my Maybelline New York Master Precise liquid eyeliner. I can't show you this on my hand, I will do with the rest, this one's dried out. This is my favourite eyeliner. It does a really 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 nice line and that's because of this thin tip it's got. So you could do a really precise line with that and I found it went on really nicely. Apparently the tip is 0.4 millimetres. But if you have a creative day and feel like doing a design on your face of swirls or stars or something, this is the eyeliner for it. Um, the next eyeliner is my Collection 2001. Uh, this one is a little bit dried out, but I'll show you a line on my hand. I think it does a really nice line. I really like this one. This is the one I used before I... I I've used this one for ages. I've used Collection 2000 eyeliner because it was the first felt tip liner I found and I, I just really liked it. But now I've moved on to a few more, obviously. But give it a try. I... I think it did a really nice line and I, I, it was my trustworthy eyeliner for a long time. Um, the most recent one, apart from obviously the most most recent one I've bought, is my Scandalized Thick and Thin eyeliner. This was my least favourite unfortunately of the four. It's got a little, I don't know if you can see that on the camera, it's got a little angled tip so you can do your thick or your thin line. Um, There's the thin line, if you point it that way, and your thick line if you hold it like that, so you hold it ho horizontal, vertically, one of the other ways, anyway, that does the, the thick line. I found it didn't really apply very nicely to my eyes, I think it looked a bit patchy when it went on, and it wasn't as easy to apply as some of the other felt tip liners. So that's why it's my least favourite. But you might like it. Some people might like it. I, I personally didn't. The one I've been using a lot recently is my L'Oreal Paris Superliner Blackbuster. This is also a thicker or thin eyeliner. It's got, if you have your little thin bit on the tip and you can turn it to the side. I find this far easier to apply than the other one. If you do your thin line holding it like that and your thick line by holding it to the side. This, I find, does a really nice line. I've got this one on my eyes at the moment today. And I just find it so easy to apply. So if you want an eyeliner that does a thicker or thin line, I recommend this one. If you want one that just does a nice, precise, thin line, I'd recommend the Master Precise. So give them a try. You, you never know. Just because I don't like them doesn't mean that you won't. But they're my recommendations. I hope you like the video, guys. Thank you. Bye.